Bruce Chard here in the famous Conk House and Andros South Bonefish and Lodge. And I'm hosting uh, another one of my popular bonefish schools in the Bahamas. We're going to tie a little Pink Panther hot to shot bonefish fly that's been spanking bones all week here. I'm going to start out with some light pink thread and some medium black bead chain eyes. And we're going to tie this on a Gamagatsu SL 11 3H triple strong hook. I'm going to wrap, underwrap these uh, bead chains here. <clears throat> Give it some balance. We're going to put on some hot pink sparkle braid. Wrap over the uh, sparkle braid, braid back to the back of the bend of the hook. And that will give us some thickness on our body. So we palm her forward. Over the center. Tie it off and trim. Now we're going to use some cream, extra select, hairline craft fur. And take a nice squatch of that. And we're going to trim it for about an inch and a half to two inches long. I like using a little bit of a bigger fly down here. The fish can see it from a farther distance. And they don't seem to mind at all trying to put it in their mouth immediately. So there's our nice wing. Now we're going to take some pearl crystal flash, about six or eight strands or so, give or take. Tie that on top. trim the equal length. Then we're going to take some salt and pepper pink clear silly legs. We're going to just grab one, one leg off, double it over, trim it in half. And then we're going to uh, tie that on top. And apply a little extra action. We're going to finish off the head. Give it a whip finish. Now we're going to give it some barred, the nice light tan, colored sharpie. This really gives it some nice body here. Nice color contrast. And I caught over a dozen fish today on this fly, so we know it's a born killer.